Now he is the voice of Shaggy, you bet he is, in Scoob, exclamation point, that my kids insisted that we watch on Friday night, and I watched every glorious frame of this. Uh, I guess that makes my children those meddling kids. He is Will Forte. Yeah. How are you, Will? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm great. It was, <laughs> I just, I love chatting with you. I'll just say that right off the bat. I the, well, I love chatting with you. You know what? so I, funny. You, you made my, uh, my plane trip seem so much cooler than, than it was. Well, let me, let me add about the last plane trip that I took with you, Will, if you don't mind me saying. It was uh, on the way back from the Big Slick when uh, you were passed out the whole way because I think you did karaoke up until the time we, uh, we took off. Will, oh I'm yeah. Not, oh well, you know, I, I'm if, if I'm going to expend all of my my body's <laughs> energy resources on anything, it's going to be carried. I was going to say that to my kids. You know, hey, for daddy points, you know, the voice is Shaggy. I watched him passed out an entire flight home from Los Angeles to Kansas City. It was a good passed out. It wasn't it was. like a sad passed out. No, it was not. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> you could I've got to tell you I mean you you under, I mean you understand the voice of Shaggy and the significance of this role in pop culture history and how did you take this one on Will this is big this is big it, time stuff sir It was terrifying I got to say like it was yes. I mean it was it, it, it what an honor to to be asked to do it but but there are some big shoes to fill. I mean, Casey Kasem yes, was an icon, and and uh, Matthew Lillard was awesome too. So so uh, it was it was scary, but but uh, um, it was it was fun to do. And did you like? How do you like? Do you download uh, previous episodes or well, like? How do how does one prepare you for did, the voice of did, Shaggy? Yeah, I just studied well. a, bu- a bunch of stuff. But my my studying something, I, I remember I did beer fest. Uh, and I had to be a German guy in beer fest, and I I studied a uh, an audio like a, a a CD on German like the first year German studies, and then also a specific thing that was how to speak with a German accent. And I for like a month I did this, and I still went and did beer fest. And sounded way more Chinese than German. <laughs> so, so you're saying you do a better Shaggy than you do uh, a German so beer fest guy? That's just saying as much preparation as I can do, it still sounds like what it sounded like. My kids loved it, man. We did the oh, whole family great. did. It was great. We spent the whole Friday night watching. It's a fun movie. It's a fun. There's so much going. It's it's all these awesome. Hanna Barbera characters that I grew up loving. It was really fun to be a part of. I know. It's just like, you know, um, I, I don't know how to, if I was dating myself to tell my kids I know all about Captain Caveman. You know, I know all about Dino Mutt. You know, where they were yep. very excited at Ken Jong because they're big mass singer people. Um, you know, hearing Tracy Morgan as Captain Caveman was a phenomenal twist on the character, <laughs> I think. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well. You know, he is the funniest guy. I mean, I, all those guys, so many funny people in this movie. Uh, right. Tracy Morgan. I mean, geez, that that guy just is so funny in it, everything. It was great. It really, really was terrific. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.